Oh, new, new, new. <laughs> Oh my god, what is that? Well, I've got the right size wheel, so we should be fine. We're back. We're back. It's only been about two months. We haven't had out show you, but we're ditched up. Like a dream. She's going back to new, new, new knee. <laughs> right, we've made it to the start of the track. I mean, it's bad enough just driving up it, let alone with trailer on that. It's going to be a disaster. This is tame compared to what it gets like. <laughs> so we've made it most of the way. It's been a bit of slamming, as you can see. Room's not very nice. <laughs> Pissed it. Oh. <laughs> Got cows. been known as the cow whisperer. How do you, Cox? You f***ing love it, you do. Come here. Right, that's it for today. But next time we see you, you get to have a little present. So we're currently on his way to pick up the present we were on about. We're meeting a man in the services near Walsall. What are we getting, Joe? Big brake upgrade. Like an actual one this time, not like what we said last time and just painted them. Uh, we'll show you when we've got them. Yeah, we'll, we'll be, uh, be there in 10 minutes. See you in a minute, Jack. See you in a minute. Oh, mate, Jack. <laughs> Get on, Jack. Right, so we've just picked the brakes off of Jack. Jack. We have got ourselves. Good size of them. Size of that. Jesus that, Christ. That is 330 millimetres. Right, 330 mil discs. And for summit that big, you got to have a decent caliper, aren't you? Yeah. Oh. So we're actually doing a big break. Let's have a look. It's red. Look at that it's big so thing. It's as big as we could get. Jesus Christ. Like, that's a and do you know what? big it, caliper. It's a big caliper. Like, put it next to your hand. Let's put it next to an iPhone. Yeah, put it next to an iPhone. At least you can get some sort of comparison then. That's an iPhone Max. Jesus, look at Absolute this. Absolute animal. So yeah, they are off. A Megan RS275 Mark III, I think. Yeah. With the adapters. With the adapters, which is old. And the, and the hoses. And the hoses. It's in Woodford. It's in Woodford's adapters were braided very high. But we want hell or just some random pels as well. Nice. Awesome. It's going to do an it's endo. It's going to do an endo. Because there's nothing in the back of it neither. Yeah. So. It'll be fading, let's put it that way. Yeah. So TJ won't be going straight on Megan. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, there'll be some lock-ups. I think that's the issue we're going to have now. I think we're going to be combat lock-ups. Yeah, I know. But anyway, let's... They are absolutely sexual, so let's get them home. Get them home. Oh, get them clean. Get, get them fitted. Right, so following on from the last bit of the video you've seen, we picked up these, we're in the services and we were on the way back. Now, it's been a while, it's been a couple of weeks or so, but finally we got the brakes to the unit, we got the car jacked up, but also, while we're here, we need to fit these Godflex rear exhaust mountings, which um, they have kindly sent to us to test out, along with the anti-roll bar bushes they sent a while ago and front lower arm bushes all god flex so good make uh, they've really helped us out so we're gonna fit them take some pictures for them and then over the course of the next year few months year or so we'll see how they hold up right so just before we get these bushes fitted let's just have a quick look at the quality we've had these bushes before on the front as i said um 
and we thought it was a little bit scrappy and it could have been better, which they have definitely achieved. Definitely stepped up the game with these. I mean, as you can tell with these, I don't know if you can see, the finishing is 10 times better on that than it were on the first lot we got sent. So thank you very much, Godflex, for that. They are also, also quite stiff. Which... They almost feel too stiff. I know. And I'm worried about the, you know, like. We're going to struggle to get them on, you know. Yeah, the beveled bit on your exhaust hangers pushing through that might be a struggle but let's have a look so we've done these bushes now bit of an emotional job because we've got limited tools but these weren't as stiff as actually we first thought to get on they actually went on pretty well i mean excuse that because it's this exhaust is not lining up at all <laughs> absolutely no movement yeah you know, Oh, look at that, we just hit 624 subs. If you like what you see, it'd be 625. So what else we need to test out on track is these babies. So uh, yeah, today's job, get these bolted up. Two bolts, T. Job done. Two bolts. Take our flexing ones off. Take the backing plate off this. Won't go see if we fit, because... I'm excited to see what these look like. Oh, we, Especially when we got that wheel. I was about to say, should we put the wheel on to see how close it is? Well, yeah. We can't actually bleed it because uh, we haven't brought any fluid. It's, uh, so it's just bolt them, up. bolt them up and let's have a let's have a look how good they're going to look. Look at that, Joe. Putting a Brembo badge on and a Renault badge. Is that dirty? I don't know. No. What will that make this car then? French and Germanish and Britishish. Multilingual. <laughs> Multilingual. Sorry, T. Just, uh, just uh, sorry. Just look at, just, just look at it. Look at size difference. That's it's going to do endos. No, I know. So yeah, if we get that bolted on, then uh, who knows? We might have a few more mods lined up. I don't know. I don't know what we what we could possibly have next. Pump it up. Pump the. And we're off. And we're off. It was a quick squirt cleaning or what? Look, quick cleaner. This is awesome. This is the best wire brush Joe's ever bought. This. Why can't anything just be nice? And we've got no tools with us. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh. TJ Brocklehurst is a god amongst men. So Joel's just done a little bit on car, which is rare. A moss flew out. No, he <laughs> his pants. <laughs> well, that's the end of it. TJ's working that pipe off. Oh, it's off. Legend. So we've hit a bit of a difficulty. We've got no Torx bits. We've brought limited tools. I hope they've got goods. I'm not going to look at it. We're struggling. No, I just... Oh, just f*** it off, innit? Next, this... next week on BPM. Yeah, we're going to have to fucking do it again. We're going to come back. <laughs> How many times does it take to change the brakes? Third trip. How many months since the last mini video? At least seven. We're sorry for we'll all you it. loyal fans of ours. What? I mean, heating it up, we've still got nothing to turn it with. And that's no use. Sure we are, mate, in red diesel garages. <laughs> I think we'll have come back, to be honest. Oh, boo. Oh, no. oh my God, what is that? Oh, oh, fucking oh, hell. Again. Yeah, get it so we're back in business. We're back in business. We went down to local engineers <laughs> at all. Found some torques in a rusty old bucket of piss. So we got our disc off. Now so, we need to take the backing plate mm -hmm. off, really. Do you reckon? Well that's it. We'll, we'll see if it fits. We'll just see if it fits at the moment. We'll see if she can just like, two <laughs> out of this. Yeah, it only needs. They don't hold it on, does it? It's just 
to hold it on while you're <laughs> putting it on. Oh, that's annoying. What? It's a nut and bolt. It's a nut and bolt, so I'll have to do that before yeah. the disc. Right, we'll start again. Starting again from... Now. Right, next. Cool. So we didn't bring any Allen keys. Allen keys, and this, this is, is on. a nut and bolt Allen key. 17 mil on... Oh, Jesus Christ. Same. We'll be back in a minute when we figured out this. Next hiccup. Hiccup. So there's those nice bracket on. I think we should make these Nearly. and sell them to the fans. Right, so the next f*** up, that's a floating... Float power <laughs> bracket. Floating power bit, yeah. Because we haven't got on tight up with, so that's that. Shall we go have a look again? Yep. Back to Keith's. <laughs> I'm going to actually take it down Keith's. Keith, if you're watching this, we shouted hello. You're not in. <laughs> Checking in. Checking in with me a file. Yeah, I'm say. There we go. <coughs> Should like it? Should we put a ring on it? Joel's in. How about them? Oh, Sue's pissing it. Oh, I'm a bit zoomed in there. Is he actually a 10 and all? Whoever this is is a legend. Oh, yeah. Does it fit? Is the question. And the answer is no. no. Oh hey! I'm not it's only old it anyway. Oh, Jimmy, then. No. no. <laughs> what do you mean you're out? Sub. <laughs> right, nineteen mil. Where is it gone? Go on, one handy. I've got to do something, haven't I? Been pissing about with the camera. You like me? What? Just wondering if we should have made sure. And we might be putting it wrong side. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. yeah. Just let's check now. Just nip them. Oh, very. Right. Just off the disc up first. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> oh my god. What idiots. I was thinking that. But I didn't think hard enough, did I? Nope. Off it comes. <laughs> right, so... Hopefully, it goes the other way. Yeah, but then the bolt... If that bolt's too long for that, it'll hit that. What will? Well, no. That no. would be precision engineering, this. It never goes smooth. Nothing in life we do ever, 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 ever. I can't believe size of this thing, you know. Look at the state of that. Why did we even waste money on M Tech discs and pads for a standard thing? They literally cost as much as Brembo discs. I mean, the discs are alright, but yeah, the, you know the rest of it was shit. And we wasted money on good fluid in it and all. Yeah, I know that's come out now. That's always a deck. Lesson learnt. Just buy the good stuff first time. This this is the lesson, isn't it? Well, I mean, you just got it. You, you might be alright. You'll be alright with the R56 if you have a good pad and disc and fluid combination. We've done it. Well, loads of people run that, so that's proven. But we thought we could try and get away with these standard ones because basically because we're skint. You've got to remember. Um, <laughs> what's it called? What? This car, the budget build. The budget build, but now we've put brakes that aren't really budget well, on it's it. not budget anymore. We're, so, on, we're on next gen. Yeah, we're on like level two of the budget build. So we've done all the budget stuff. And now... It's going to be... Well, good. saying that, it's still on a budget because we haven't worked it out, but technically these brakes and those mods over there that you might have seen already, we're all paid for by that breaker mini we got. Yeah, we've not actually spent any money on this yet. We've not spent a lot on it. And anything we have spent has been earned through like little odd jobs and stuff. So, out of our wage, it's free. That's all that matters. Am I going FFT with these? Just check it's the right way first again. Oh, I've already gone. Make sure it's FFT. You know what you're like. You've had wheels fall off. It passed. I've had one and it didn't fall off. It just very loose. <laughs> it's looking. We're looking right anyway. How are we looking? Good. Should be fine. Right? We're still on one side. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we've only done that. We, we put it on the wrong way. Oh, look. Lesson learned. Ready? Don't feel like it's 
There you go. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Jim, what do you think, Carl? Cousin Hench. She's going to sit in there, yeah. Apparently. Have you got it? There she goes. Right, that's it. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Looks a bit oh. sharp, that bend, Mary. Is that right? Nah. Just pull it through a bit. Yes. Oh, right. Oh, it might have been. No, it's going to stop, isn't it? Yeah, just. You'll be fine, that, isn't it? Do you know what I mean? What, like that? Yeah, I think so, yeah. Always yeah. fiddly, these Doesn't things. 11 mil. Yeah, 11 mil. 11 mil? Yeah. 11 mil. Right, so why are they pissing about with that? Let's talk to you about the plans in the next few weeks. So, I imagine this will be a track day booked. And the plan at the moment is we're going to run it like this. So, see how these brakes make a difference, which is going to be massive. Uh, and then after that, we've got some mods to the old engine to do. Stay tuned, subscribe to see what we've got coming for that. But we're going to have the brakes before the power, but the power's coming after this track day. So, track day coming up. Thanks for all the views on the last track day, by the way, because that's our best video so far. Well, in on the mini, anyway. <laughs> I'm glad we got some likes out of because it took some edit. I think we're about 100 likes. So, yeah, don't forget to like the videos if you like them, because that tells us. Make it worth me getting me out of Yeah, <laughs> makes it worthwhile. And if the bad, we, we, we'll take a bit of criticism in the comments. Oh, are we going to end up needing bigger space? No. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, we've got the right size wheel, so we should be fine. They, well, they don't fit. Well, we've got the right size wheels. Spacer. Yeah. It's, it's like... Really? Yeah. Put this side on and not see what. That's oh, like. There's a spigot still on it, like. Right? Basically, what happened is we bought the wheels without thinking. They were the wrong size for even the standard brakes. Oh, the wheels! And now <laughs> they're still the wrong size. <laughs> yeah, this is going to make us hit the arches a lot you more and all. Let's see if that goes on. <laughs> That is... Is it still touching? We need new wheels. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's an absolute disaster. Oh, that's bad. We need some new wheels. Yeah, we need to know what offset and all that we need. This we have as no big idea. as possible. So, it looks mint, but we've got, I don't know, what's that? How many spaces? That's, I think, I think that's about 25 mil. I think we bought 12 and a half. We just wedged it up there. About and 25 mil. We're still touching the caliper. It's, it's, it's literally and a nasty kit. With that much space, so we've got some poke, so that is... How much poke is it? A lot. A lot. I mean, when it's on the ground... Fucking hell, There'll be a bit, of, yeah. bit more negative camber. Yeah, yeah, but there will be natural, We'll just be it? smashing that arch, because we were anyway. Yeah, I know, but negative three camber will never be ready. I don't think this is a set up to run. Well, we can't run it. Anyone would like to buy a set of four ultralight 17 inches with NS2Rs with plenty of life in? In the two front. of them. <laughs> yeah. Has anyone got a set of Team Dynamics 17 inch 4x100? Or if you run the Megan RS and Brembo's on your mini, let us know what offset wheel you need without spaces. Or with small spaces. Or with spaces, just not 30 mil ones. That's that that's that. concluding that video. We'll see you on next. Come back for the next one to see it was fit. <laughs> and <laughs> our new wheels. And maybe some new wheels. <laughs> well, we'll have some sort of plan anyway. So, like, subscribe. Sorry about the end. Comment, help us out if you know anything we don't know about these. Yeah, any ideas, let us know. Thanks for watching. See you later. Try. Peace. Bye. Bye.